Hey everyone, welcome to Vigara University. Today, I'll show you how to capture credit card information when customers book a service or class online. This feature makes it easy to enforce a cancellation or no-show policy by allowing you to charge a client's stored credit card. Before getting started, you'll need to open a merchant account so you can process credit card payments. Afterward, you can require a card hold when clients book online. Let me show you how it works. We'll start by navigating the settings. Then, under the Things We Sell section, we'll select Online Shopping Cart. This is one of the premium features in Vigaro and will cost an additional $10 on your monthly bill. We'll select Get Started to activate the feature. Once activated, we will be able to configure our shopping cart settings. We can require a deposit or capture credit card at the time of booking services or classes. The options for services and classes are separated so we can configure different rule sets for each. With each setting disabled, customers will be able to book without having to input any credit card information. If we select Capture Credit Card, we can set a minimum threshold to require a card hold when booking. For example, if a customer books a service that is $50 or more, they will need to enter a credit card to book the appointment. We can also automate our cancellation policy. We can enter a cancellation or no-show fee as a dollar amount or percentage, then set the cutoff time. If customers cancel within the set time before their appointment, Vigaro will automatically charge the fee. In this example, customers who cancel in less than 24 hours will be charged 50% of the cost of the service. Next, we'll determine which appointments will require a card hold. For online booking, we can require card information from new customers, old or returning customers, mobile appointments where we drive to the customer's location, and from customers with a set number of no-shows or cancellations. We can set the exact number of no-shows and cancellations to require a card hold. If we select new and old customer appointments together, all clients will be subject to our credit card capture rules regardless of appointment location or number of cancellations. Below, we can review and modify our appointment cancellation policy. A clause about our cancellation fee will be added to the beginning of our policy. The fee and cutoff time can be adjusted by modifying the numbers above. We can configure a separate deposit or credit card capture rule set for class bookings. The same settings for services will be available for classes. Once finished, we'll select Save at the bottom of the screen and our rules for credit card capture will immediately apply moving forward. When booking online, Customers will need to enter a credit card when booking services or classes where the price exceeds our set amount. When booking in-house, our staff will be prompted to enter a customer's credit card. We can enter the customer's credit card information or choose to override and book without a card on file. If a customer tries to cancel their appointment after our set cutoff time, they will be prompted to pay our set cancellation fee. When canceling an appointment in-house or marking the customer as a no-show, our service providers will also be given the option to charge a cancellation fee. We can send a custom message to the customer, charge a card on file, or enter a new credit card and collect payment. For more helpful tips and tricks, click the Vigaro University link in the description below.